Hello guys, Apex Rise here with another video, and in today's video, I kind of want to talk about um, a DLC that is going to be coming out for Black Ops, uh, what do you call it, that's going to be coming for Black Ops 3 very, very soon, and that is, well, very soon for the PlayStation 4, that is, um, May 16th for the PlayStation 4, most of you already heard of it, Zombies Chronicles, I'm actually pretty excited, because myself, at, when I was very, not very young, but first starting, to play Xbox, I um, what do you call it? I played a lot of uh, Call of Duty Zombies, uh, especially on Black Ops One and Two. Mainly one though, because at the time that's when I was youngest, right? So, uh, that's yeah. Anyways, um, they have a whole bunch of remastered maps coming up for Black Ops Three. Ascension is one of them, which is what we're playing here on Black Ops One. There's Ascension, Moon, Shangri La. Those are three from Black Ops, actually, and Kino, they're toting. That's four from Black Ops 1 right there. Um, then we have Origins. Then we have Barucked, Shino Numa. Um, and hold on. There's eight maps, and I'm trying to think of the last one. I'm missing one. Kino to Toten, Shangri La, Moon. Did I say Origins yet? Maybe I didn't. I don't know. I can't remember. I have a m bad memory right now. Yeah, well, yeah, I forget. But, um, those are the maps, that the ones I at least said anyways, those are some of them. I'm pretty excited. I played all of those. I played, um, I played a lot of Moon and Kino a lot. Kino is actually one of my, it's not one of my, it's not like one of my, like, favorite favorites, but it is one of my, like, favorites to play back when I, like, like to, you know, go back and experience what it was like back when I was younger playing Zombies. Kino is a very good map. I love that map a lot. I'd say, though, like, out of all the maps that they're adding... One of my favorites is Ascension, which is what we're on right now. It's just so cool. Start off in black and white, turn on the power, and you get color back and stuff. It's a really fun map. Um, I'm not really too excited for Shano, Numa, and Varuk. And, oh, and Nocturne and Toten. There we go. I forgot that map. But the, I don't know. The World at War maps, they're not really my favorite, other than Dereze. Dereze is a really good map, but I don't know. I don't really like Varuk and Shano, Numa that much, but I'm still going to play them to enjoy them. Uh, and sadly, in these remasters, by the way, you will not be using the old guns from the old games. You'll be using the Black Ops 3 guns. But it's still pretty cool. And I just like to let you guys know I'm going to be recording footage of that one that comes out for the Xbox. Which will be Ju in June. Probably like June 15th or 16th. I'd like to say June 15th. If I check on my calendar real quick, I could tell you. Probably. Because they come out like a, like for Xbox, they come out like a month later. Um, but yeah, if actually, actually, hold up. If anything, it comes out June 13th for the xbox or or on a friday who knows but um yeah that's pretty cool uh excited for that also the hot wheels pack is uh out, or expansions out for xbox one you'll be seeing a video on that for next week because i'll be getting it like i don't know when probably this week so you'll see a video next week for that which is pretty exciting so stay hyped for that card it is uh being edited right now it's not done i want to make this one really good it may not seem too good because <coughs> Like, I'm just getting really busy, and I really want to, like, I want to make it really good. So, it's going to take a bit more time. 200 subscriber montage. After the edit, then I'm going to start working on that. Because, like, I cannot do two edits like that I at, I, at a time. So, that will be after the card. Card it will be done soon. Hopefully, it shouldn't take too long. Um, neat, A little reveal for the Need for Speed 2017 has actually been out and released today that I just heard about, which is pretty cool. Apparently, they have listened to the community, and there's a 350Z going to be in the game, so we got the dank VQ35 life in there. I'm actually really excited to hear about this game, because they've been working on it for like two years now, which is pretty cool. And Need for Speed, they like to listen to the community, so I'm excited to see what they have to bring. Hopefully, they have daytime in their game, finally. And um, and a 350Z, maybe a G35 as well. Maybe uh, they're missing a couple of, like, they they missed out on a, a lot of stuff for, like, or wait, no, sorry, that's Forza. Forza was missing out on a lot of stuff, like, when it comes to body kits for the Miata, but Need for Speed didn't miss that. I just wish, I wish their handling was a bit better, and the map wasn't always at night, and there was a first person. That'd be pretty cool. But other than that, the game was awesome. Great customization, but yeah, um, that Car Talk video did very well on this channel. I'm glad to see... I'm glad to see that you guys actually really liked it. So there will be probably another one tomorrow instead of 
in two weeks. Like I said, I was like, probably another two weeks, but no, we're going to do one quite soon. So hopefully you guys uh, stick around for that, and I'm excited for that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, subscribe for more videos. We're at 216 subs. We're climbing up really fast, and I'd just like to thank you guys so much for that. Keep on, keep on going with the support. The support has been great recently on the channel. And, um, yeah, we're catching up to my friend Colin. So, Colin, we coming for you, bro. Um, he's at, like, 200, like, 30-something. So, we coming for you, Colin. But thanks for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Pizzah, dude. Pizza, no, I'm not, I'm not phased at that. All right, see you guys. <laughs>